Osiris was like family to me. You've never even met him. I know. Just let me speak to Sabathun, please. No. I won't give that witch another chance to dig her claws into you. Maybe she's right, Crow. You know I am. Sabathun is already in your head. You're a liability to the mission. Why do you have such a problem with me, Petra? Five minutes, that's all I'm asking. The Queen of the Reef forbids it. Well, I don't take commands from the Queen of the Reef. Sabathun unraveled the Dreaming City with a single wish. I've spent years trying to contain that mistake. Better men than you died because of it. To my ear, it sounds like you're the liability. Maybe your queen's trust in you was misplaced. A knife against a hunter? <laughs> I'd be more careful who you pick fights with. Another step, and my corsairs will have to prepare you a second grave. Save it for the hive, both of you. This isn't getting us anywhere. Thank you. We could all probably use a minute to cool off. Oh. Oh no. Keep both eyes on that one. You can't stop the inevitable. No one can, though Petra Van seems perfectly willing to try. I've always sympathized with Crow, you know. All the kind words I shared with him as Osiris were sincere. I know what it's like to be in exile. To be hated for things outside of your control. It would be better for Crow if we talked. I want to explain why I did what I did. I want him to know that my affection is true, because the less he knows, the more vulnerable he is. Doomed to be strung along by false promises from supposed benefactors. But then again, I'm the one trapped in the crystal prison. What do I know? Venge thinks I'm vulnerable, and I'm supposed to just take a seat? Like I was the only one fooled by Savathun wearing Osiris' skin? You'd known him far longer than I thought I had, but I don't see her forbidding you from speaking to her. Because it's not about me. It's about who I was, isn't it? Every time the Vanguard tells me that things will get better, I thank them. As if it's a privilege not to be beaten to death. Our past lives aren't supposed to matter. I'm beginning to wonder why I'm the only guardian being judged by mine. No more apologies. No more creeping around on eggshells. I deserve an audience with Sabathun. I deserve to know how much of what she told me as Osiris was a lie. I deserve answers.
I don't need to be Marasov to see into your mind, Guardian. You think I'm making a mistake. You think I barred Crow out of pettiness. I won't say I didn't recommend it, but it was the Queen's order for his own safety. I see Prince Aldrin's arrogance in him, his desire to please. He's vulnerable. Aldrin and your Crow are echoes of each other. Surely you can see that. They share kindred weaknesses. Sabathun will exploit them again if we let her. But with Mara back, I can finally see the end approaching. It's been a long time coming. There are still Techians in need of your strength. I wish I could fill their place, but this must be how things are. I'm here if you need me.